Hey, my friends, I've just come out to a place called the Lord Ted in Farndon, Nottinghamshire. It's a Green King pub and they do a breakfast. So let's go and see what it's all about. Nice big place. Go around the side, there's plenty of seating here. Also, there's a playground if you want to bring your kids along. Oh, look at this. This is very pleasant. Look at these things, my friends. You can sit outside in your own like little hut. Look at this. How cool is that? And there's also this incredible outside dining drinking facility. Just look at it. Oh, they've really pulled out all the stops here. So this is the all-day big breakfast here, which I'll be trying. Two sausage, two bacon, two free-range eggs, two hash browns, half a grilled tomato, butter mushrooms and baked beans served with toast and butter. Oh yeah. Nice looking place. There you go. Plenty of inside seating. There's even a claw machine. Good morning, can I have your big breakfast please? Of course you can. Thank you, and can I sit outside with one of those pods? Yeah, I'll, I'll just put you in the middle one straight as we go out. Lovely, thank you. Do you want a drink? No, thank you. Yeah, it's a nine pod tonight. Excellent. Grab what you want and go to your table. Is this 109, bub? Oh yeah. Very pleasant lady, just going to wipe the table down for me. Thanks so much, bud. Well, they breakfast. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, real thank you. So here it is, my friends. We've got this nice toast at the back and the butter's been put on it, so it's melting gently. Can you see that? That's a handy little thing to do. And we have the sausage, and it looks nicely cooked. The tomato has been grilled quite nicely. Look at this. Then we have the mushrooms, the hash browns, which are crispy. The back bacon looks like it's been fried properly. We'll see what it's like when we get it in the gob. And finally, two eggs. And it's nice to see that the egg has had a bit of splatter chucked across the top. I'm going to start with the mushroom. I love these things. Oh, the mushrooms are superb. If you've ever had those mushrooms that you get with steaks, they taste just like that. Really good. Move on to this hash brown. Let's open it up. Oh, it was crispy on the outside and the fork went through it nicely. Oh, the hash brown is lovely. It's crispy on the outside, fluffy in the middle. It's got a little bit of onion in there, adding to the flavour. Okay, let's break the egg. Oh, nice. Looking good. Decent bit of runny yolk action. Albumin all cooked properly. I'm gonna get a bit of salt on there and on that tomato. Push the butter around the toast, that's right. Oh yeah, it's melted nicely so I can even spread it with the fork. Oh, I'm liking that. Right, let's get in that egg. All right, let's have a go at that. Oh, that was lovely, yeah. The toast in that real butter, all with that egg yolk. Marvelous combination. Let's go try some of the albumin next. So as you can see, it is nicely cooked. No slimy bits. Oh, it was really nice, actually. It's got a lovely density to it. It's not sloppy at all. Give the beans a go. Fantastic, perfect to the bite. Real nice chew on them. Not too much sauce in there. That is a decent bean. You all right, boys? It's actually going very well. <laughs> <laughs> Now this is the best coloration I've seen on a tomato at the breakfast thus far. So let's give that a go. Absolutely, that is properly cooked. It's not hard in any way. It's not cold at all. It's got a lovely bit of flavor because of this on top. Yep, decent tomato. Right, let's have a look inside one of these things. Looks okay from here, like a medium coarse mince and a nice brown tip. Let's give that a go. Oh, that was a hearty bite, my friends. The consistency of the sausage innards is really good, like quality. 
it's not mushy at all it's got a nice bite to it and i can taste some pepper in there in the background some black pepper yeah good seasoning now move over to the bacon i'd like that fat done just a little bit more for my liking but let's taste it anyway yeah that's got a lovely flavor to it and a decent consistency in the gob as well it is rather meaty it is a decent cut of bacon but like i say i would like that fat done just a little bit more although it's pretty good on this bit here Okay, I'm going to see if I can demolish the whole thing. Kitchen manager just came out and sat opposite me and asked me how things were going. Very friendly, very friendly team here at the Lord Ted. Right, let's crack on. Steadily getting there. About halfway through, my friends, and everything on the plate is still hot. Well, I'm this far through it and I am struggling a bit, my friends, but I'm going to plough on. Almost there. I forgot to press record, so I've plattered the last bite. But I can tell you right now, my friends, just want that bacon fried a little bit more. Other than that, that's my favorite breakfast to date in the breakfast series. And I got a nine out of 10 to the last bite. Right, that's that clattered. Time to go home, have a cup of tea. Ample parking. Okay, let's go, Coco. <laughs> <laughs> And it has a little bit of onion in there as well to add to everything. I'm going to be a blizzard. <laughs> right, I'm now going to... Oh. Oh. oh, focus you fool. Oh, they would be cutting the grass right next to me, wouldn't they? Yeah. 